that cabin across the lake. Oh, it's adorable. Okay. We are officially in the Alabama mountains. Tim has never seen where we're at right now. It's Tim and Terry time, and we're headed to Mount Chiao. And this is awesome! <laughs> Golly, Pete, look at them little cows. It's a, it's a, oh, it's dogs. Okay, y'all, don't look at them little dogs. I thought it's cows. Don't laugh. Tim's gonna laugh. All right, y'all. These are serious hills in Alabama. This drive is as much fun. Might even be more fun. Might be and funner. Than no rails fun. on the side at all. <laughs> We're in Alabama. We don't need no rails. That'd be a good place for a trailer right there. Timothy, Timothy, Timothy. We're entering Claiborne County. Okay. I'd love to hold this a little bit stiller than I am, but it's, too, it's just hard to do. And we do have a crack in our glass. Sorry about that, y'all. Yeah, we was riding down the road the other day, and we heard a rock hit the wind, and it sounded pretty bad, but then nothing happened. And two days later, Tim went out, and the crack was halfway across the windshield. He said, can we fix that? I said, I don't think so without calling the glass company and replacing the windshield or something. And then we got up another day later and it was all the way across the car, all the way across the windshield from side to side. We'll get around to it one day. <laughs> Wee! That was fun, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, we could get on a bicycle or something. Ride on this thing. I think we're going to turn left up here at 281. Wait and see if there's a sign, but I think I'm right. But yeah, I'm right. Look right. at that. I am so right. About See? time you're right about something. <clears throat> if Tim would just listen to me, I've said this before, I will say it again. If Timothy would just listen to me, we would get there a lot quicker. Most of the time. Actually, that's not true, y'all. I'm just going to be honest with you. Usually, if I say go left, you really should probably go right. Yeah. But this is Alabama. And there's something about Alabama that I just know. It's Tim and Tammy time. And we're at Mount Chiha. Thanks for watching. Please like. Please subscribe. This is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Shoot, wait just a minute. I get on one of these rocks over here, you're gonna see what's awesome. That's a big, big foot. Yes, Two thousand four hundred and seven feet. Tim's about to climb three million two hundred and fifty-seven thousand steps. Hey, look, that's a statue of me. Look at those muscles. No, he's too short. This is Alabama's highest point. He looks just like a guy I know over at uh, Pine Mountain. Yeah, he does, don't he? Civil oh, there's a bench. Oh, y'all, look at that rock. All right, dear. 
Follow me. Jagged rocks too, good lord. Tammy, you have a bad back. Remember that. King of the mountain. <laughs> Y'all, you know, if I was going to have a pet rock, <laughs> that would be my pet rock. Yeah. Now, Tammy, I'm pretty sure there's an age limit on this playground. You're much too old for it. I need to head on down memory lane. Now that I've... Okay. There used to be a really cool playground here and they took it away and they replaced it with this... Uh, everybody's got a playground like this. That's a cool <laughs> playground though. <laughs> Isaac and Amber would love it. I agree. However, I'm going this way for a minute moving over here in the woods okay now all this outcropping of rocks right here I've played all over these rocks right here first time we ever heard about Chiha was in 1982 when my grandparents lived at Hollis Crossroads and that was the first we ever heard about Chiha but then when I married Steve my first husband we got married in 1990 and he passed away in 2012 but when we first got married this was one of our only dates because you know i don't know this is one of our only dates we came out here to chiha but then after we got married this outcropping of rocks for some reason i don't know why it was this one in particular but all these rocks right around here i guess it's because it's right by the playground all of our children have been here and played on these rocks and everybody who would come and visit us, because we lived in Talladega, so all of my little cousins, because I'm the oldest cousin, all of my cousins came to visit with me, and we brought all, every one of them over here to Chiha. But this right here, and we brought Steve's cousins and family over here with us too, all of our nephews. Yeah. Yeah, I'm on memory lane now. Okay. <laughs> well, you know, not to not to compare her first husband with me. He was a great guy, but my understanding is she brought he brought her here, and their lunch was a bag of potato chips. I took her to Jack's. So there you go. <laughs> yeah, when well, me and Steve came up here on our date, he had these uh, trailers. He had these lots, and he had trailers on them. And the people that were supposed to pay him that weekend always paid in cash, but that weekend they paid him with a traveler's check. So he brought me up here and he had no money. I, however, had money in my pocket, but being a man, he couldn't allow that to happen either. So he did, he, we, we, we shared. I allowed it to happen, but you know. <laughs> we shared a bag of chips and two Cokes. But let's back up. Let's back up just a little bit, back up a few years. This is how, this is how my life went. I'm going to tell this story right now. Oh my goodness, don't trip up on a rock while you're doing it. I'm going to try not to, but this is the way the story goes. When I was 10 years old, I met Tim. That's me. That's, that's this one over here. Yeah. Uh -huh. Met him at church. With a Venom shirt and a Captain America hat. That's how cool I am. <laughs> when I was 14 years old, I met Steve at church. When I was 17, I dated Tim. He broke my heart. Yeah, well, I was young. And then... And then Steve showed back up. And he, uh, we had a whirlwind romance, got married. 
remember now when you're talking about me in those days. I was young. Kindness matters. Kindness matters. I'm being kind. You the one who did the heartbreak and I didn't. So me and Steve got married in 1990 and we were married for 22 years and had three beautiful children and then he passed away and the year that he died, earlier that year, Tim experienced a tragedy and then my family experienced a tragedy and then somehow me and, me and Tim ended up talking on the phone and we kind of we kind of grieved together on the phone for a long time and then it mean a long time yeah a long time and then we just we got married and that's how you come to have tam and tammy time and how we ended up at chiha today now i'm gonna tell y'all this because i think this is kind of cool we ended up at chiha today because of prime time travelers they have a youtube channel go check them out they were just here at chiha but i just watched their video and when i watched their video it just brought back so many memories and i said you know what I'm going to, I'm going to take Tim. He's never been, never been in Alabama mountains. He's never been anywhere we've been today. Well, he went through Wadley. He's been to Wadley, but he never got out and went to the other places and actually in Wadley. This is the Red Bud Pavilion. That's what it says. And it's got a nice fireplace. Now. Yeah, I got to say, if you change that D to a G, it would be Red Bug Pavilion. But yeah, okay. It's yeah, a possibility. Man. I think they're, yeah, they're on the outside. I don't know. I think the way I want to go is over here. I don't know. Well, I think on the other side, okay, all right, we'll be back in a minute. Are you ready to climb the steps? Yeah, I reckon so. Let's go. Back up his hill, we ain't gonna climb the bank steps. I, I was gonna say, we, we come downhill to use the facilities. We should have gotten the car, drove down here and then drove back up. Now we gotta go up the hill. Then when we get up the hill, we have 50,000 steps to climb. I needed to wax nostalgic, let me be. Well, that's fine. I love that tree. Oh, there's lots of trees out here to love. Yeah, there he is. I love is. the rocks. I love the trees. This is one of my favorite places I've ever been. Just noticed this view of the new playground that's a tree looking thing you didn't know it was a tree house it's a tree house honey. yeah pretty cool okay they got an age unit this is built for me though i see my baby right there oh. yeah i bet I love the stuff on this ground. This is tires. Just recycle tires. Yeah. Well, you know, I can swing too. Can you now? Hold the camera. In fact, let me film it. Please. Please, 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 please. Oh boy. Okay, Tim's gonna swing for us. Woo! <laughs> Wee! <laughs> I have done this in a long time. I'm not going to jump. Please don't. I need you in one piece. There we go. Oh boy, that was fun. Don't stand in the sun this hard. Mm -hmm. I'm 
See, we can do this. What? Where you at? Tammy. Where you at? Wave. Hi there. <laughs> yeah, it's a little bit childish, but you know, I'm a child at heart. You're a what? Child at heart. Well, my heart's telling me right now, heart's you're an idiot. <laughs> Just about there. Yeah, it's just a little. I hit the hat with my camera. I hit the camera with my hat. Since I've almost got my breath caught, <laughs> we are in the tower. Highest point. And even Tammy is tired. <laughs> anyway, there you go. When you're up here, you can tell it's the highest point in Alabama. You can't. You can see it's everywhere. Beautiful. Yeah, that's Pointers up here, like we do at Chattanooga, showing you what's which direction. You know, yeah, you, you haven't been to Chattanooga yet either. I'm gonna get you to Chattanooga. Well, you know, they do that in uh, Smoky Mountains, too. Look, there's a fire over there. Did you see it? Oh, that's in the valley between the oh, two. Oh, yeah, it makes you think it's a huh? Smoky Mountains, huh? I'm surprised, though. Yeah. Smoky Mountains are mist and clouds. That's yeah, right. I know. Oh, you can stand. And then there's a small little staircase to the very, very top. Okay, now, how many stairs? About 20 or 30. <laughs> they felt like, you know, 200,000. <laughs> you ain't right. 